the next day in my time of sin rock after what we found out all the information about the water who's sapling in the water figure out what's going on now okay come on everybody just popping up we can make it easy on you my boy sheriff Kindly remind the criminal what he's charged with. I, uh, right. Aru, you're charged with unlawful destruction of property, theft, hijacking, kidnapping, and resisting arrest. It's a long list. You're the ones. Hmm. Did you say something? All you need to do is cooperate. Isn't that right? Tell us where Logan Ooh, is. Ooh, he's an and Andy. Your sentencing will be reduced. Drastically. I don't have anything to say. Fine. It seems Haru has made his choice. He refuses to aid us. He denies his wrongdoing. The only thing left to do is to charge him and put him in a cage where animals like him belong. Pastor, I don't think... Before we adjourn, I open the floor. Will anyone speak on behalf of this criminal? Anyone at all? Mr. Yeah. Audio, you have something to add? Uh, yes. May I? Right. Well, let me just say something on behalf of my good friend Haru. Ahem. Obviously, he's been brainwashed. My friend Haru would never do something so terrible. He's a good guy who just likes making skin cream and stuff. There must be some mistake. Please, just let him go. Arvio. Yes. We'll take your words into consideration during sentencing. Now, if that's all... This is no time for games, Builder. I must say, though, I do find it very curious that you would speak on behalf of this bandit here, seeing as you two have never met. Unless, perhaps, in fact, you have. Pastor, let them speak their piece. Are you going to accuse everyone in this town of being a bandit? Yes, he's right to be suspicious, Minister. Skinny, uh, uh, the Builder, which survived a fall that even I would have had trouble with, and coincidentally just happened to be exactly where we suspected Logan's hideout might be. Is there something you're not telling us, Skinny? How did you survive that fall? I'm just better at it than you. What is the matter with you two? That's enough. Please forgive me, Minister, but we've always suspected Logan had a spy in town. How else did his gang know the exact time to kidnap you? Or what Franco looked like? I just never thought it could be. Our builder. What's your proof? Think about it. They showed up just as Logan's notoriety was rising. And then Logan robbed the train, blew up the water tower, kidnapped the minister. And the only constant was the builder. Mm, yeah, but I wasn't there for when it blew up. So, that was like most people around come to see it, and then I rebuilt it. They were always there right after each and every event. Almost like they're surveying the results. Not only that. It was them that was looking around Logan's house. It was them trying to sway Elsie to Logan's side. And when the Civil Corps finally got close to getting to Logan's goat, guess who was the one that let it get away? Hmm. <gasps> no way. So you admit it. Arrest them at once, officers! With pleasure. I'm going to ask you the same question as the criminal here. Where is Logan? Looking for me? There he is. Logan, Logan. thank 
Hang tight, Haru. I've got this. You giving yourself up, buddy? Yeah, something like that. What are you all waiting for? Get him! What a welcome. Don't you want to hear what I have to say? Huh? Citizens of Sandrock, what if I told you that there's been a vile plot to destroy your city in action right now? It's better to show than tell. And stop him! You see? That's your water. The real villains ain't us. It's Miguel and Penn. They've been working with Dan for a long time to keep water out of our oasis. They work for Duvos. You said... your reports. What's the meaning of this, Miguel? You did this for what? Money? All this time? All our sacrifices? Let's not all lose our heads here. This is... This is obviously some trick. The Builder... The Builder must have planted some machine in there. Logan's corruption is consuming you, turning us all against one another. You slack-jawed nitwits won't stop him, I'll do it myself! Ah, ma'am. Getting her to the doctor, ma'am. How could you? We trusted you. I... I believed your sermons. Of course you did. Because I speak the truth. You sound real crazy right about now. Silence! You fools. I could have saved you. But now you have resigned yourselves to a slow and painful death. Stop making sense, pal. War is coming. With Duvos, we'll kick their Sarabus back to the damn wastelands just like we did you. <laughs> Not likely. So what? You plan to have us dry up? To aid the war effort against the Free Cities? The weakening of the Free Cities means less bloodshed in the battles to come. Are there others? In other city-states? Couldn't say. Why are you so loyal to these guys? Your whole operation is busted wide open, man. You think they're going to take you back with open arms? You're going to need witness protection, if anything. Duvos is order. The Free Cities is on the path to another day of calamity. You're joking. Far from it, old friend. Look at yourselves. Look at the weapons pointed at me. The Church of the Light prohibits such monstrosities. And yet, here they are allowed. They encouraged guns, bombs, that maddening mechanical armor, a living AI. When does it end? What does it stop? I'll tell you. It doesn't. The free cities will keep making allowances until the old world is new again. Your so-called freedom is destined to enslave you. Duvos is our only hope. With power in the hands of the few, the wise, the masses will not be allowed to destroy themselves. As for me, I've all but succeeded. Uh. Water level really hasn't been what it used to be ever since I arrived. Gone are the days of the hustle and bustle this town once had to offer. Hardly gravel now compared to the so-called jewel it once was, this town. The once lush oasis is now but a puddle, soon to be covered wholly in sand and dust. And best of all, how easy it all was. It was right in front of you, plain as the day is bright. You monster! Enjoy your tears of peach while they last. The true end of Sandrock is upon you! Pen! Extraction! Looks like the cat's out of the bag. Aw, oh, man. Not you, too. Sorry, folks. Just my second job. Hmm. <clears throat> Watch out! 
What? <laughs> Looking for this? <laughs> He's still you... No matter. We're leaving, Miguel. Be careful. Where do you go? Ow. I'll point again at him. There we go. Shut it, old man. You're lucky I'm bothering to save you at all. All right, I'm gonna have to show you something I've been secretly working on. Super. <laughs> Take that, you big treacherous Tulupa. That's funny. Hey, else, long time. Didn't think you'd see the day where I saved your butt, did ya? People really sleep on the monologue surprise attack technique. Nice one. Uh, is everyone okay? Of a show. You all were <laughs> incredible. I knew Logan was still with us. Yeehaw! I second that notion. Yeet Who'd have thunk it? A conspiracy. All right under our noses. We need to check on Minister Matilda. Oh my gosh, we do. But wait. Logan, man. I, uh, still gotta arrest you as well for all the stuff you did. Right, Trudy? Hey, Logan. We... Still need to settle your situation after we clean up what happened today. I know. Are are you with us now? Always was. Well, I'm just glad all's well that ends well. Yep, no loose ends left to tie up. Yeah, glad this is over. Gonna have to do a lot of paperwork for this one. Say, where do you all think Miguel commissioned his water stealing contraptions? Yeah. yeah. Commerce Guild, on the double. Let's move. Oh, why, hello, it's you, the brutish criminal. Turned over a new leaf, have we? <laughs> nice of you to barge in. Yes, I actually have a train to catch, so if you don't mind, I'm afraid I must bid you all adieu. Yeah, by the powers vested in me on behalf of Sand Rock City Hall, I hereby place you under arrest for fraud and mass conspiracy. I do, I, I mean... I didn't do it. Don't make this hard, pal. All right, all right. You've got me, fair and square. Now, I think we can all still be civil about this. I mean, that is the name of your little boys club, isn't it? Civil core? Well, yeah, we can be civil about it. That's the attitude I'm hoping you to have. I don't want to make a show of force like we handle Penn. Did you see how that went down? That's right. Bide your time, old Yan, old boy. You've gotten out of stickier situations than this. You just need to think of a plan. Think, think, think. Well, whatever you do, definitely don't look inside that glass cabinet behind you. That's where I keep my most incriminating evidence. Hey, stop! Hmm. And when you write in your annals of history, narrow as they may be, make sure you get my name right. Y A N. That's capital Y, capital A. So long, stick town. Smell ya never. Uh -oh. When you lied about the turtles, I should have knew it was gonna be all downhill from there. 
And I've been waiting a long time to do this. <laughs> Wait, no, Rocky, oh, buddy. Oh, pal, <laughs> just let me go. I've got connections. I'll give you anything your heart desires. You freaking mops. <laughs> no, I was shaking it. I was doing it. Yeah, you have to hit him before I did. That wasn't fair. Oh, gosh. That felt oh, good. Suddenly, I feel all my anger washing away. That was one heck of an uppercut there, Rocky. You been working out? Yeah. Wait, you weren't at the trial. How did you know Yan was responsible for water hiding machinery? Water hiding what now? Huh. We'll take it from here. Thanks, Rocky. My pleasure. Hmm. Rocky knew more. For the fire. Who are you calling log, blockhead? Wood related wordplay can't save you now. Our oldest and beloved Commerce Guild Commissioner was in on it? Uh, who could have seen this one coming? I feel like my whole world's getting turned upside down. There were the numerous allegations, but I admit, this goes much further than I'd ever imagined. Excellent work, Civil Corps. <laughs> Good of you to join us. Couldn't you losers have lost five minutes slower? What? Uh huh? Snap out of it, you imbecile! You call yourself a knight. What? Why are we in handcuffs? You lost! That doesn't sound like me. You're the imbecile, pastor! Can't even keep a stupid door locked! We had a good thing going. Look, I'll settle this one for you boys. You're all imbeciles. <laughs> the reason, of course, being crime don't pay. That's the truth. Just take us away already. Enough of your incessant rambling. Hey, now, you can't rush justice. <laughs> well, we did it. I don't know how, but we did it. With your help, we saved Sandrock. How long has it been? Finally, I can rest my head easy for the first time in what feels like forever. And my paw. This is... This is what it was all for. This town, these people, these lands. From here on out, it's on us to make the most of it. So the Logan saga is ended. Citizens of Sandrock. Hey, wait a sec. You're just gonna let this fellow walk back into town? Uh, Logan might have been integral and unraveling a deep-seated conspiracy that was a threat to the survival of our nation. But this ain't justice. He blew up our water tower back when. No, I didn't. Yeah, yeah. Well, I mean, okay. But you still did hijack the train. You kidnapped the minister. Logan is now cooperating with Sandrock authorities and will be dealt with accordingly. Throw the book at me, Trudes. More important to address are the shocking revelations that have come to light today, all before our very eyes. We have fallen victim to a Duvos plot. It is with a heavy heart, I must admit, that I too have been fooled. Hen and Miguel were never who we believed them to be. Take solace in the fact that no lives were lost today. I've received news from Fang that our minister's condition is stable. Let us pray for her to make a speedy recovery. But make no mistake, this was an act of aggression. Our lives in the free cities may soon be very different. We may have uprooted the corruption laying among us, but it hardly seems plausible that Duvos's singular goal was to dry up Sandrock. Regrettably, we must expect more. If not here, elsewhere in the Free Cities. I intend to speak with our representative, Gregor Sick, immediately, and will inform you all as soon as possible what the Alliance advises that we do. Please, everyone, stay safe and conserve water. Logan, Civil Corps, and Builder, you too. With me. Fill me in on what you know at City Hall. Can y'all take ten first? I got a million questions for Logan. As do I. Sure, sure. Take your time. 
That was a lot that went on. Things weren't quite I just hope like you that. can all forgive us. We thought you lost your mind. Hmm. I didn't see any other way. Howdy. Hey, uh. that's a good ride going in the end. Be right. seeing you. It's good to be back. The stakes were too high. Only we Howdy. Thank you. Thank you. So long, partner. Are you okay, Mr. Haru? I did what I had to do. Hey, kid. How you holding up? A well-fought victory, all. I noticed Elsie seems to have picked up a few new moves. I was impressed. That last attack. Did she learn it from you? No, that's something my pa used to do. I see. So she really is dedicated to learning how to fight. Maybe we should ask her to join our gang. Would you coots listen to yourselves? Talk about new moves and recruits right in front of me? Yeah, we're bandits, but I thought we were at least above torturing one of our own. Let me back in the gang. Teach me your pa's moves. Yeah, force her back in. I thought that went without saying. Y yeah? Well, you should have said something. If you ain't say it, it ain't official. Look, things were getting gummed up. I needed you here. Out of the line of fire, but still keeping an eye on things. You did good, kid. Well, you're welcome. It weren't easy. Some of the sand rockers are all right, but I had to use manners, learn chores. They even made me ugh, learn stuff. Oh, yeah, one more thing. Let's not forget, if it weren't for me, you all'd be sandfish food. Pen's relic weapon, anyone? That was amazing. Yeah, I don't know if we could have handled Pen without your help. You'll have to tell us how you managed it sometime. We missed you, kid. It was boring not having you around. So, yeah. Welcome back. All right, it's official then. The gang's back together. Woohoo! Say, we're going on the straight and narrow now, ain't we? Can we still call ourselves a gang? Let's go with Monster Hunting Gang. Uh, something like that, sure. Oh, yeah. Couple of people we're gonna need. Jasmine, hmm. she's see what they have to say. So, so much has happened. I think everyone needs Hi. some time to decompress. Finally, this is over. And it's all thanks Whatever. to you. We Thank you. Really. She's in the gang. The builder. Definitely get the builder. How did you get caught? You, I ran sure. into Pen. I thought I was careful, but I guess I messed up. Went back to the old hideout, grabbed some things, and Pen was there waiting for me by the cliff. I shouldn't have underestimated them. <clears throat> you hurt. They threatened a lot of things, but mostly just ended up asking questions and bickering amongst themselves. Perhaps someone neglected to tell them how important honor among thieves truly is. What do you I plan to do to next? Back to Sandrock, if possible. Help take care of Andy. Logan and I will have to wait to see what the Civil Corps decides for us. But we've been helpful and cooperative. I expect leniency. I've missed out on a lot of things that I'd like to be a part of here, too. I'm interested in the greenification efforts. Also, isn't Katori building a theme park? I... Uh, have some experience in this. Yes, you do. Oddly enough. Happy to help. Where'd the other two go? Where'd they go to? Hmm. The other two ran off. Don't know where they're at. Gotta find them. Hey there. So long, partner. Where's my horse? Nope. Don't have him on me. There's Burgess. So I wonder who's going to take over the Commerce Guild. Justice, I got a situation to report. I rose this morning, put the kettle on, put in my toast, and started doing the laundry. About halfway through the wash, I realized I'd left the toast burning in the toaster. Uh, Grams, I got a couple other cases to get through today, so if you don't mind, uh... All right, all right. You used to love hearing my stories. Point is, 
for the life of me. I just cannot find my magnifying glass. I got reason to believe someone went and crept in through the window and snatched it. They did. I'm on the cats. Magnifying glass? I mean, why would anybody do that? Uh Miss placed it. Nerve of you whippersnappers. I ain't lost a magnifying glass yet. And this I has nothing to do with now. what mm -hmm. we're doing. I'm we just probably you, pretty much going to find her magnifying glass. Probably had well, to find it. I mean, it's the first time I heard of a stolen magnifying glass. Oh, it must have been a real nice one, right? Jewel encrusted, solid gold, handed down for generations, so on and so forth. Goodness, no! I've known you since you were playing Yak. Oh, I'm gonna skip on, this. That is rude to eavesdrop. Take a look at my. Huh? What? That can't be. Oh! Come on. I want to. Sheriff, get on. your authoritative presence is required. Sorry, I do. <laughs> oh, man. But my jewelry. My back turned for naught but a second. And some lawless vagabond absconded with my rare limited edition ring. What? Limited edition? Not just some I want to get with the main story. I was working on the main story, and you had to get stuck doing this. Gosh, I'm hiding. I know I'm playing, but it's all right. I was into the story, and I was trying to. Logan and Andy were about run off. Indeed, lawman. To an artist such as me, it is priceless. Of course, to a vendor, five goals tops. But you I was hoping to get to talk to him for this episode ended. No, no. To fit within my refined wardrobe, its true worth was immeasurable. I'm not going to be able to. <sighs> right, right. Now, don't worry, folks. I think I've got it all about pieced together. Just rest assured that the Civil Corps will fulfill our duty to handle all y'all's problems. No matter how small or, but we are a little short-handed. Hmm. Well, if it ain't our humble but hearty builder. Wait. Don't tell me you got it lost something, too. Phew. That's They're just lady. looking for Logan. Yeah, say, we're a bit short-handed at the Civil Corps right now. City Hall is having us form a scouting party down south. Uh, Happy to help. All you got to do is speak with all of our... All right. I'm all... I'll talk with them later. Well, since this episode... I no, sorry, I did apologize rushing through that. It's just a little mission on part of the main story. I was trying to get it done before the time ran out for this episode, but sadly it has. So don't forget, if you're new to this channel, hit that subscribe button. Also give us a thumbs up like or greatly help us out. And everybody have a great and wonderful day. Goodbye.